please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. What's up, Raptors? Today is Tuesday, February 20th. I hope you guys had a wonderful long weekend. It is the start of a brand new week and it's a short one, so make sure to make every moment count. You guys got this, now on to the daily news. What not to do in foods class by Little E. Wash down and sanitize your tables. Does this count? Is this good enough for my yeah. hair? <laughs> Yeah, push Sanitize, up. girls! Oh, okay, this okay. Stuff. oh, wait, I don't like this. I don't look as cute this way. Ooh, oh, you don't even know what you're doing. Look at how wet it is. Isn't that how it's supposed to be? Stop doing it like that! What did they do wrong? Some things they did wrong are acting like animals, whipping each other with towels, and touching their hair so much. They were dangerous with a knife, messing with their hair when cutting, and not looking before asking where something is. Please do not eat when cooking. You can get sick. If you are sampling when cooking, your germs can get into the food. Do not use a lot of soap. The program does not have a lot of money to spend, so please be respectful of the tools. I'm gonna ask the next kids if they have better. I am not taking the blame for you for this class. It's blame. Who filled out and didn't fill out the recipe? I did. Who's supposed to be doing what? Whatever. Do not. Play with the soap bubbles. Oh, it's so much 
What should you do? You should clean up after yourself, read your recipe, keep your hands clean, help out your kitchen, and listen to the teachers when teaching. Bye Raptors! 8th grade algebra class by Kira S. This week I will be asking different students what they're doing in their algebra class. What's your name? Name? My name is. What grade are you in? What are you in? Eight. Are you in? Eight. What are you guys doing in class? In algebra right now. We're working on function. A function relates an input to an output. We're doing a math right now. We're learning about slope intercepts and we're doing plots. A slope is the measurement of how steep a line is. Do you think this subject is hard? Not really. It's hard. I, in my opinion, I think it's hard for me. Bye Raptors, have a great week. Upcoming testing, what tests are we gonna be taking? NMM SSA testing, New Mexico measures of student success and achievement. This is a mathematical test for students grade three through eight. The dates will be on April 15th through the 19th. NMASR testing, New Mexico assessment of science readiness. The testing dates are April 22nd through the 30th. Good luck on testing. Attention 6th, 7th, and 8th grade boys and girls interested in trying out for the James Monroe track and field team. Google Meet requirements. You and a parent slash guardian must attend one of the three Google Meets starting at 6 p.m. on the following dates. February 8th, February 15th, and February 22nd. The Google Meet code is JMMS track. Joining the meeting through a student's Chromebook is the best option. Tryouts will be the week of March 4th, right after school in the gym. Requirements. Please visit the school website at jamesrenero.aps.edu and click on the athletics tab for important and required forms for tryouts. Then click on the track and field link for detailed information regarding dates and times for each grade level, physical examination requirements, and all required paperwork. Students will not be allowed to try out if they do not attend one of the above listed mandatory Google Meets and turn in all the required and correct paperwork for review to Coach Travis by February 28th or sooner. Thank you and go Raptors. Have a good day. Have a great day, Raptors.